So I just got my package from Napoli Naturals, which is this apothecary um, shop. And then they also sell herbs and a bunch of other different like health and beauty products. I'm out in Los Angeles, California. I went there to visit my brother back in 2021 of April. And I just fell in love with their shop. So just going to show you guys what I got. Oh yeah, so this is like, what was it? A tortoise shell or seashell? I kind of forgot. I think it's some type of like a shell. Maybe the tortoise was just the color they were describing. Um, I don't know what's in here. Is it the Palo Santo sticks? Maybe it is. Something that comes with this. Maybe it's actually like a stand to put the bowl on. I'll have to figure it out, but I'm assuming it goes like this and then holds the shell while you light incense from it, which is, I think, its main purpose. Um, or back. sage. So like back. that. And then I think the bowl. Like sits on here. I don't know. I'll have to figure it out, but it's. I just thought it was so pretty and cute i don't burn um and says so often but i bought some from the mall the other day and just figured i would try a couple different ones i stopped because i heard like different um reviews about it being kind of bad for the atmosphere like breathing it in and this and that but mine would be very seldomly so i don't really have an issue so that's the first product then there was this um, toothpaste that I was just looking at. So um, it seemed like kind of different. Like I've tried the charcoal toothpaste and all that, but I figured I would just try something different. And then, so I didn't even touch on this with a lot of people, but back in March. Are you your game? Yeah, in one second. I've been having really bad sciatic pain to the point where I took off like two different Fridays in a row and then the next Friday after about a week I was just like yeah I gotta go in so I made an appointment basically we just found out that because it was in both hips but it started in my left kind of dissipated and it's been in my right for over a month now um, but at that time I had went into an urgent care walk-in and they couldn't find anything wrong in the x-rays so they were like it has to be sciatic pain maybe a possibly a pinched nerve um because it just kind of kept on kept on um it doesn't really affect me during the day but mostly at night when i'm trying to sleep so i just seen this and hope that this might help me a little bit with my joints um and i don't know why i got this one but i just um we've been into like olive oil trying to take more olive oil so I thought that maybe like the olive leaf had some like benefits to it I'm sure there is I just can't think about any of them right now but I know that they're like the good fatty acids when you actually take the oil but I just figured I would like try out this leaf maybe in like a tea or something I can't do it I'll help you in one second okay this is the rose hip and hibiscus facial serum I've never done serums for my face and I see so many people doing it so I was like, you know what? It doesn't hurt to like give it a try, like maybe after a cleanser and um, moisturizer. I don't know if you put this on before moisturizer or after, but I'm gonna have to look into that. But it just sounded pleasant. Let me see how this stuff smells. Oh yeah, it's like very subtle, but the fragrance is in there. And that's kind of like what I like too, like something that's not so strong, you know? Then it can be like overpowering and kind of have the opposite effect to it. Pomegranate molasses. Um, I thought this would be really cute to put on anything that would need a substitute in placement of sugar. So like ice cream, smoothies, like toast, or just whatever, you know. I mean, it sounds really good, pomegranate and molasses. So I'm going to have to give that a try. Is there anything in here? Probably just wrapping paper. Um, there's this little bag. 
I'm trying to think what might have came in it. Oh. Here's the Palo Santo. Funny story, I bought this at a we'll farmer's market and then I gave it away to my son we'll to take to school for his teacher because Mom. she said that her... Mommy! Owen! We'll okay, game. just give me one second. She thought she had a ghost and I don't know if she was playing or not, but I was just like, just give it to your teacher, you know, tell her to light it and like wave it towards the windows and doors all around the house and just say a prayer. Like even if you're not religious and like... Even people, like, in my religion, which is, like, non-denominational Christianity, like, don't believe in this kind of stuff. But, like, when you think about a lot of things that people have in common with religions, like, they all have prayers. So, I really do believe in the power of prayer. And um, whether that's affirmations for people, like, I'm not here to judge and say this is the right way or this is the wrong way. Obviously, if you want to pray to God, like, that being first, that can be something. But I feel like this... You know, whether it be this or sage or just lighting a candle, you know, praying over oil, putting it on people, like just whatever, you know, like just pray. And like, I think that's the best thing you can do is put positivity out into the world um, through affirmations and prayer. So I thought that I would get more of those. And then I got this honeydew me, which is probably like a honeydew melon. I can't. Little, um, like a body butter. I think. Mommy's game is so there's that so Mommy's game is and rest. sweet lotus i had recently gotten these lotus tea leaves to drink because of the effects um that those have so i thought i would get these two smelling ones oh this one is really sweet this one is gonna be bomb this is like what you put on right after the shower what about this one i have a feeling this might smell like how bath and bodies used to This one actually is sweet too. I'm not a much of a fan of this one as I am of that one. This one kind of smells like bubble gum to be honest, but I bet after a while, like when it warms to your skin, it might have like a pleasant after effect. So these are all my little apothecary items that I got from Nat Napoli Naturals out in Los Angeles. So if you guys are like into any holistic items or herbs or just whatever candles um different scents like stuff like that like something that's bringing you a little bit of happiness joy or peace in your life um, let me know what you like i'm always like up to try new things and i always find it interesting going into these kinds of shops mainly because of like jewelry aesthetic like rocks and stuff and just like whatever someone has to offer you know See you guys in the next one.